Hello everybody, YouTube, and especially those of Instructables who are watching this little tutorial that I've put together for you. And there's no doubt you see this here that I've created. My Xbox memory card, the USB adapter. Bro, a broken memory card. Hang on, my nose is... God... <clears throat> stupid nose. Anyways, yep. Here it is, all together in its full functioning glory. Over here, we got what well, I'm going to test it with, since I don't have any small USB memory cards that work. This is an old one gigabyte hard drive made 1990, 1995, September 95 to be exact. Not an exact date, but it's a one gigabyte hard drive with an adapter going to a USB cable end here. I've loaded up my Microsoft Dash here since it'd be the easiest to tell if this is working or not rather than through my Unleash X dashboard. So let's plug her in. Oop. And now the USB. And you'll notice I got the it's hard to you see I got the USB port put in where that you put stuff the proper side up. And now it's plugged in. And it's screwed up, but it does that sometimes. And voila. It shows up. Controller 1. Notice no other controllers plugged in. Control 1A. Xbox hard disk. Yeah, that's why I called it. No, wait a second. That's not, what, that's not it. My bad. There we go. I have not messed with it really, but memory unit 1A. No lie there, 1A. Cord goes, and you notice that there have got no other con And just to prove it, here's the cord. Follow it. Follow it. Follow. Right down there. See? So the control I got is 1A. USB cable. Follow it. It goes across my controller cable. Get that out of the way. The USB cable. All the way over here to my USB hard drive. Lights up. So, there you go. Working USB memory card adapter for those who don't want to modify their controller. And since you can get cheapo memory cards off eBay, I think this would be a better solution for some. Yes, I know if you got the big memory sticks, they'll stick out by, like, by a mile or more. But let's face it. Some of those memory USB memory sticks only stick out that far. So you plug it into the adapter and it'll only stick out to maybe there. And you can get up to 4 gigabyte ones like that or bigger. But since the memory card limit for the... USB interface through controller ports is 4 gigs. A little stubby 4 gig drive can sit right there. So, there you go. I don't know if I'm the first to do this or not, but I've made you a little instructable to do it. For those of you watching this on YouTube, link to the instructable on how to do it is down below in the description. Thank you, have a good night, and this has been another video brought to you by Megasonic Dude 10